ಸೇಜ್ ವ್ಯಾಸ ಲುಕ್ರತ್ ಸೇಜ್ ಸನತ್ ಕುಮಾರ ಅನಾಸ್ಟ್ ಮಾ ತಪಸಿ ಟೆಲಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಗ್ರೇಸಸ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಶಿವ ಸಹಸ್ರ ನಾಮ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಗಿವ್ ಬೆನಿಫಿಟ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಲೋಕ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅಟ್ ಪರಲೋಕ ಸೇಜ್ ಸನತ್ ಕುಮಾರ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿಲಿ ಬಿಗ್ಯಾನ್ ಟು ಸೇ ವ್ಯಾಸ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಟೆಲ್ ಯು ದ ಥೌಸಂಡ್ ಹೋಲಿ ನೇಮ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಶಿವ ವಿಚ್ ವಿಲ್ ವಾಷ್ ಅ ವೇ ಆಲ್ ಸನ್ಸ್ this is not said by me it is a must that one should have the grace of that lord to tell his holy names that lord shiva gives boons to his devotees he is the lord of this entire universe he is very soft in nature he is the doer of everything he knows everything he has special guna he is boundless and great he does not get disturbed at any situation he exists from time immemorial he is uncomparable and remains sukshim he is mahan he is a pure consciousness he is omnipresent he adores the state of mukti he does not have ego does not possess any karma and he is not carried away by illusions he is sada shiva bhutanatha vedaswarupa all sages only aim is to attain that sarveshwara one should meditate on him as the one in the color of spadika with jadamudi five faces 10 hands one body and two holy feet in his five right hands he holds a trishul which denotes icha shakti gnana shakti and kriya shakti the axe maru which is parashakti swarupa the weapon katvanga made of bone and skull with vajam bijapuraka and vajra and the abaya hasta which gets rid of his devotee's fear and assures protection in his left five hands he holds naga pash which controls the stool sukshm bhutas nilotphala ankush damrukam and the vardahast that blesses with bog meditate him along with the bells that arises sound agni that destroys parivatta fragrance garland and a smile I will tell you all the thousand holy Shiva names that my father told me. At first, there was 10,000 holy names. As how one churns the curd and takes butter, and as how a mountain is broken to take the gold within it, my father Brahmadeva, on realizing the meaning of the 10,000 holy names in his mind, extracted this thousand holy names from it. These holy names are in acceptance to the four Vedas. Whoever tells these holy names and prays, their sins will go away. Only one who does a great penance can recite these holy names. This will bless us with calmness and prosperity. This will even get rid of yakshas, rakshas and devils. These holy names are divine. This should be given as upatesh only to the ones who are devoted and have faith in God and has shraddha. This should not be given as upatesh to those who do not have shraddha or to the one who is not devoted towards God or does not possess his five senses in control. The ones who have hated towards the Deva Deva Lord Shiva who holds the bow pinaka though their ancestors may have done good deeds and have attained positions at Svargaloka due to their Bhagavat Abhachara Dosha they will go to the naraka lok along with their ancestors this shiva sahasra nama is jnana dhyana and yoga at the end of the life span due to the punya one has attained from earlier births if he is able to recall these holy names then even if he happens to be a great sinner he will attain the best positions this is punya uttama and most of species The Sahasra Nama is the best of all stotras. I will tell you that here, said Sage Sanat Kumara.